probably the vantage point where I can give you a slight idea of how big this place is. It used to be they'd say there was about 70,000 people uh, walking in and out over the course of the weekend. That number is definitely higher than that now. It's, it's pretty massive, but it's spread over a large fairgrounds area in the center of the city. And if you look, you'll see a large Guinness banner. That's home base for me. That's where USA Kilt sets up every year to sell stuff to uh, all these fine people. And it's amazing how many USA Kilts kilts I'm seeing here. It's actually really humbling. We're pretty much the kilt provider for this festival. It's kind of cool. fish and chips. The haggis is actually pretty cool too considering it's you know it's like canned haggis, it's American haggis, but uh, it's it's as good as you're gonna find at a festival around here. the biggest and the best so and and, and I think all other festivals know that and we say it at other festivals like this is the biggest and the best and this is where uh, you get the best crowds Why Celtic music now then? Uh, well, our family is very, very Scottish on both sides back. So, like growing up, we had Celtic music just playing through the house.
You ready for next year? Oh yes. Okay. Bring it on.